India and the UK are poised to strengthen their collaboration in advanced sciences through a framework agreement. In an interview, UK Science Minister George Freeman highlighted the partnership's focus on semiconductors, high-performance computing, and artificial intelligence, among other key technologies. The British government's increased investments in India's semiconductor ecosystem are expected to materialize in the next year or two. This announcement comes on the heels of SRAM and MRAM Technologies, a British firm, revealing a 30,000 crore rupees investment in India's semiconductor ecosystem. Major commitments have been set for the UK to shift, after Brexit, from being a service economy to being more of a science, research, and innovation economy. UK government has made a 30% increase in our R&D budgets so our total budget for the next three years is £52 billion. The UK and India's alignment in the field of semiconductors reflects their commitment to fostering technological advancements and innovation. Addressing concerns over data localization in trade talks, George Freeman expressed optimism, stating that these differences are perfectly resolvable. Both countries recognize the need for close cooperation and respect for each other's perspectives as they work towards developing a robust global science and technology economy. When asked about potential investments from UK companies in Indian semiconductor firms, George Freeman highlighted ongoing explorations with the Indian government to identify mutual synergies. While specific investments were not disclosed, Freeman anticipates rapid growth in investments and collaborations in the semiconductor sector within the next year or two. Although the discussion on India's digital technology did not take place during the recent meetings, George Freeman acknowledged the significant progress India has made and the potential for the UK and India to work together in setting regulatory standards in the evolving digital economy. George Freeman highlighted the UK government's investment in OneWeb, a satellite communications firm. The UK government has a 17% stake in OneWeb which gains significance considering the world moving towards a globally connected commercial space. He emphasized the importance of globally connected commercial space infrastructure and the need to avoid cluttering the lower Earth orbit. The focus is on utilizing regulatory leadership to support interconnected satellite infrastructure and encourage SATCOM security through quantum encryption. As the UK and India strengthen their partnership in advanced sciences, both countries aim to leverage their respective strengths to drive innovation and contribute to the global technology landscape. With a shared vision for scientific progress and regulatory excellence, the UK and India are poised to make significant advancements in the fields of semiconductors, high-performance computing, and more.